Good morning, you guys. So today I wanted to jump on here and do a look using my Kylie the Bronze palette. Don't think I've done a look on my channel using this, and I had um, I look in mind using this and the Stila Magnific. What's it called? Magnificent Metals Glitter and Glow today. So I have already primed my lids using my L'Oreal um, Infallible Pro Glow, and filled in my brows using my Benefit Goof Proof Brow Pencil. So let's just jump right into the look. So basically what I have envisioned for today is a super like bronzy eye, glittery lid. So let's just see if my look comes out like I thought. So I'm going to start off with the Morphe M504, which just looks like this. Gonna clean it off because I have been using this brush a lot lately since I bought it. And I wanna go in with um I'm gonna go in with this shade first, which is called Tiger Eye. And let me turn my mirror on, guys. I feel like we're a little crooked. Mm, maybe not. Okay, and we are just going to buff this over the crease. So I'm actually like super proud of myself. This is the third day in the row that I am filming a video. So I'm kind of like just like in the mood for filming lately. Which I was in like a little slump where I didn't want to film. I didn't know what to film. I didn't know if you guys liked my videos. So I, I just wasn't like feeling it. But I'm like really in the filming mojo lately which is good. So I'm really hoping to stay in it. And you guys are, I feel, super crooked. So let me fix you and I will be back in just a second. Okay, I think that is much better. So let's just keep going with the look. So like as I was saying, I really want to keep in this mojo of trying to film as much as I can. This week's schedule for work has been a lot easier to film and get stuff done because... I'm working six days this week opposed to the five that I usually work and two of those shifts were broken up so I worked one day 7 to 11 so then I had the whole rest of the day and then the next day I worked 5 to 9 so then I had the whole whoops, whole rest of that day um, beginning of that day to like film and do what I needed and today is my only day off so I'm going to get filming done editing I'm trying to upload a video today so I'm trying to get a lot done so now I'm taking my Morphe M518, which is just a little bit smaller but still fluffy. And I'm going to go in with this shade right here, which is called Topaz. Right? Yes, Topaz. And I'm going to put that in basically the same spot but just a little lower so you still see the other shade peeking above. This um, also could be a prom look. Um, I think you could do this as your prom makeup. It's going to be glam, but not like... Well, I mean, I guess for prom you want to be pretty glam. And let's be honest, whenever I say I'm not going to be glam, I'm just going natural, I still go full-on glam, which is fine. So now I'm just going in with this really small Morphe brush. It's the one that has no name because it's from that set. And I'm going to dip into this shade right here, which is called Habitite. And we are going to, oh my god, I said that's so weird. We are going to put this super low in the crease. Just going back and forth and bringing it up slightly and above. Okay guys, so that's what we're working with so far. Um, I'm going to move over to this brush from that set I got from TJ Maxx that I don't know what brand it is, but this is called the Crease Contour Brush. I'm just cleaning it off because I did use it yesterday in blue and I'm not going for a blue eye look today. Now I'm going to go into this super deep brown shade right in the middle and it is called Bronzite. Just packing that on the brush, and I'm going to put that 
right in the deepest point of the crease. Just like that. And then dipping back in, doing the same on the other eye. And then I will go back in with the Morphe brush. We just used the no name but super pinched. And I will just take the brush with whatever products left on it from the previous color to blend out the line a little. And then go back in with the first Morphe brush, which is the M504, to just blend everything together. So next for the glitter, we're going in with my Stila Glitter and Glow Magnificent Metals in Kitten Karma. And we're going to put that all over the lid, but as I, I was just thinking, I think I want to go in with this shade in the palette first, which is called Goldstone, kind of as a base. I mean, you don't need an eyeshadow base with these because they're super opaque, full coverage, but I just want to put a little something down. And I'm just going in with this um, little e.l.f. flat shader brush. And I just dropped my palette. Hold on, guys. Oh, no. Oh, there it is. Okay, sorry about that, guys. I'm not going to spray this or anything. I'm just going to put it on the lid. Just so there's a little something down. Now the shade isn't much unless you do spray your brush. Let me angle you down just a little. There we go. Um, it's just kind of like a light wash of shimmery glitters on the lid. Which is no big deal for today because we are just going to cover it up. So now I'm going to go in with the glitter. And I'm just going to apply it right with the applicator. Guys, like, this is literally so pretty. I don't know if you can see that, but this is gorgeous. Okay guys, so there's what it looks like with the glitter. Super pretty. I wish I had my phone with me. I would turn on like my flashlight like Jeffree Star does so you could see all the shimmer and glitters. So you can go ahead, you can do two coats, you can do one, you can do whatever. I am actually going to go ahead and do two coats today. But with one coat, as you can see, it already is super opaque and shimmery glittery so you don't need that second coat. But I am extra and I'll like more of everything. Okay guys, so here, there we have that. I am going to let that dry and actually work on the lower lash line a little bit with you guys. Going in with that same Morphe brush I've been using, the little tapered small one. And I'm actually going to go in with this orange in the middle of the palette, which is called Citrine. And just smoke that underneath the lash line. Oh, put rays off in the eye. And then I'm going to go in with this shade on the bottom, which is Hematite. Same brush. And smoking out a little more. Okay guys, so there we have that. What I'm going to do is take my ring finger and kind of like pat out the glitter. Just so there's no like chunky spots or anything. And it actually is pretty dry. So I'm going to take the Morphe M518 brush and just slightly blend out the tops of it. Because I don't want it harsh and chunky like it is right now 
that's the look you like, that's great, but that is not what I am going for. And it probably will get glitter on your brush, but it's not a big deal. So then what I want to do is go back with, oh, where'd it go? Um, I cannot find the brush I want. Huh. Guys, I lost my brush. Oh, no. No, oh, no, I really don't know where I put it. Well, um, since I can't find the brush I want, I will just go in with the same Morphe brush I have literally been using for everything and just blend this out even more. Okay guys, so there we have that. I am going to go off camera and do the rest of my face and I'll be right back. Okay guys, so I'm back and I finished up my makeup. So to finish off the eyes, I used my Kat Von D Tattoo Liner in Trooper and the Limelight by Alcone Mascara. And the lashes you see on are from the Paris Hilton Live Love Lash Set. So that is it for my eyes. I think they turned out super good. And honestly, this really does look like a look that I would wear to prom. So I think that's what I'm going to title this video. For my face, I just used the L'Oreal um, Pro Glow Foundation Powder, which I already put it back. Sorry, but that's what I used for the face. I wasn't in the mood for foundation because my skin is very dry today. I just kind of want to let it breathe. I mean, I know I have a whole bunch of other stuff on my face, but I didn't want to wear foundation. So for my face, I used the Coco Collection by Kylie. And I used the bronzer, the blush, and I mixed these two highlights. So I used this whole palette to do my face. And then last but not least for the lips, I used the Kylie um, Velvet Liquid Lip in Birthday Suit. Oh, and for face spray, I used my e.l.f. Aqua Primer Mist. Well, that is it for the look, you guys. Let me know, know down in the comments what you think of this look. And leave me any requests, so don't forget to... Subscribe to my channel, tell your friends about me, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.